Well, promising Thunder coach Mark Degnolt and then some preparing for Golden State at Paycom Monday. First meeting, rookie sensation. How about Santa Clara Williams, so athletic. Pick 12. He continues to be re-ranked in the top three in that rookie class. And how about some Kenrich Williams just simply makes play after play after play. Thunder win by 12, one game below 500. Crazy. OKC in the state of Oklahoma feel like they're getting more optimistic with all of the good happening with the Thunder, and this is all without the player that had people drooling. The second overall pick, Chet Holmgren. Dean, what are you seeing? John, I, I love seeing the Thunder play teams with more stars, more talent, and, and see those stars get frustrated, OKC's style of play, especially the Thunder's tendency to beat a lot of the big boys. But if you listen to opposing coaches analyze OKC, it's clear they'd love for their teams to be more like the Thunder, unselfish, always moving, same with the ball, fundamentally outstanding. Rarely do they not give their best effort. And then the SGA factor, he really frustrates people, always under control, savvy with the in the lane moves and uncommonly good decision making for a guy headed towards superstardom. And watching Josh Giddy's improved shooting as well as others, don't forget Sam Presti's added his San Antonio pal as a shooting coach. The under the radar move, aren't they all with Presti? Adding Chip England, arguably the league's best, John. Well, they've been fun to watch, and I love how uh, SGA is under the radar, not under the radar, but he plays under control all the time. And yep. one thing that's become obvious, we've got a lot of Williams running around here for more on one of the Thunder